purpose of this video is to make a comment on the internet, common licensing, and its effect on the internet, its effect on society. Uh, the internet allows people has allowed people to create their own spaces, um, to create communities, to come together on a worldwide level. Um, for instance, something I never thought or expected to ever happen was to get an email from a presidential candidate. Um, but at first I was, I thought it was like a joke and, um, but later realized that the internet really helped President Obama, it had a big impact on him winning the election. Uh, millions of people are always, you know, checking their emails to, and he knew, they, his, his campaign knew that, uh, that would be a big a great way for him to get exposure. So my point is there's no limit to what individuals can do um, with the help of the internet and common licensing. Common licensing is going to allow people to be more creative in their uh, attitudes, in their, in their works to get, to express things that we may not otherwise see. You know, people are willing to do things in their own homes or on their own cameras and allow others to view it. I think the common licensing also, um, you know, it, it takes away the worry that we don't, that we'll have to be, pers have to be uh, worrying about legal issues worried about being caught up in lawsuits and things like that. If an individual is willing to put their work out there and uh, not worry about people using it, people can use it for free, then uh, the collaboration with others is going to be tremendous. And if that piece of work does become commercial, commercialized, then uh, everyone involved Will, can be compensated for their share of the work. People will just be able to to do more things. To we won't be put into this little box to say that, like for instance, with television, we're always shown what I guess a few higher ups feel is what we should be looking at. But with the internet, you know, people from all over can say, hey, you know, why don't we do a certain thing this way or why don't we do some a certain thing or try something a different way. In Michael Wesh's video, um, An Anthropological Introduction to YouTube, he says that these videos are a celebration. And I agree because I think one of our deepest goals in life is to be happy. So if, if putting videos on, on the internet is helping people to be happier in their lives, then I just think that there's, they're creating a, a place for a, just a space that will create a better world, help create a better world. But I also think that people have to uh, take this creativeness, use the, in, use the internet and, um, reach out to to others on a on a personal level you know we as a community have moved away from uh, our connectedness connectiveness with one another and I think this may be the catalyst to bring us back together as a community uh, of sharing our ideas with one another of um, you know, just being kinder to each other. Uh, we should look at this as a way to move out of our little corners and really uh, connect, like one on one. Let's say, for instance, you're in a grocery store, or you're in a, you're at school, or you're walking down the street, or wherever you are. 
to just, you know, look at the next person, you know, have a nice comment to say or, or give a smile or just that type of um, passing it forward type of thing, something to, you know, to, to, to bring us back to an environment where, you know, we say, hey, we care. So I think the internet and common licenses is, is a possible way to just make this world a better place.